All right, guys. Uh, just give a little shout out my song. I wanted to go over a couple things with you guys too. Maybe get you guys uh, opinions and whatnot. Um, originally, I had this CPR, which uh, hung on the, hung on the side of my tank, like so. And I was using it for my seven-inch sock. Well, <clears throat> I wanted to keep that off the, you know, the front of the tank. It kind of, you know, I already got my skimmer here. And uh, I want to give a little bit more room because my idea was I had a bubble trap. I don't know if you can see the silicone right here running down. I had a nice bubble trap here. I ended up getting rid of it, um, kind of trying to make one big refugium. So my idea was uh, I actually got this from Aquarium One. Um, got a seven inch T, PVC T, and actually put my six inch sock in there. It fits perfect. Um, my idea is to kind of pipe it in to this uh, skimmer aspirator pump and uh, actually drill a hole for the tubing to go through it so everything that comes down my tank kind of runs right through there. I'm hoping that will uh, help things out a little bit better. And that way I'll fill in the rest of the sand down here and kind of make a pyramid of rocks around this pyramid that I made. I think it will work pretty good. But a uh, little shot of my skimmer. It's a Coralife 220. Um, I did actually change the pump. Mopar had uh, an extra bubble blaster off the uh, Reef Octopus. And I kind of wanted to see which one would perform better. So uh, that's the Reef Octopus right there. Pump. And you can kind of see, you know, it's, it is skimming. It's doing pretty good. No complaints here. I just kind of want to compare the two. And I can dial it up a little bit more. As you can see. It seems to be working pretty good. And then I got my other one over here, which is another 220. And this is the regular 220 pump that Coral Life gives to you. I mean, it's really, really close to comparison. Um, I don't even know if I'd give an edge or not. But uh, I'm happy with it. No complaints here. My nitrates are pretty much none to very, very minimum. Usually minimum being after heavy feedings, but uh, I'm happy with them. I've heard a lot of complaints online, but uh, they seem to do the job in my tanks, 55 and a 75. So I hope this helps out. I did add two more corals. Um, there's a Hollywood Stunner. Once again, I got from my buddy Mopar as well. It looks like it's doing pretty good. And I also forgot to show you guys. Uh, this was my hippo move. My, I think it's a Pokestar. Monty. I'm not sure. It does show a little blue behind it. But that's my guess. And then I also got the staghorn over here the other day as well from Mopar, so we'll see how he does. But yeah, just give me some thoughts, tell me what you guys think.